Hey folks, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're all doing absolutely fantastic. So we recently reacted to the Star Spangled Banner and the reasoning behind how the words of the Star Spangled Banner came to be. And I thoroughly enjoyed that. And since then, I've been looking at, you know, some other patriotic American songs. And I came across this one by Toby Keith, specifically called Courtesy of the Red, White and Blue. Now, I love country music. I haven't heard this song yet and I thought it would be amazing to get a live reaction to this. So yeah, I guess without any further delay, let's just get right into it. This should be good. This should be good. American girls and American guys will always stand up and salute. We'll always recognize mm. when we see your glory flying. There's a lot of men dead. So we can sleep in peace at night when we lay down our heads. Man, okay. First of all, beautiful, beautiful opening. When he refers to old glory, he's clearly referring to the American flag. And, you know, I love that, that little line he says that many men have died so we can, you know, lay down our sweet head. You know, I spoke to uh, an American army veteran the one time and I got his insight into, you know, his life's journey. And the one thing he said to me was that was very powerful that he fought for his country for the people that weren't able to. It's just such a very noble thing to do to put your life on the line for your country. So I'm glad he made the reference there, you know, that the men have died so we can sleep peacefully. Toby Keith's father was also a uh, part of the US military and I believe the song uh, was inspired by the by his father's death as well as the 9/11 attacks because this song came out soon after that My daddy served in the army yep. we lost his right eye but he flew a flag out in our yard till the day that he died wow. he wanted my mother my brother my sister and me to grow up and live happy in the land of the free now this nation that i love is falling under attack a mighty sucker punch came flying in from somewhere in the back as soon as we could see clearly through our big black eye man we lit up your world like the fourth of july Don't mess with America, baby. Love it. Toby Keith never disappoints. Very, very patriotic song. Uplifting. Justice will be served and the battle will rage. This big dog will fight when you rattle his cage. And you'll be sorry that you mess with. Wow, wow, wow. Beautiful. Good job, Toby Keith. So this song, inspired by the events in 2001, 
2001, I think was released in 2002. Those that do know this song and can remember what they were feeling when this song came out, please let me know in the comments what your feelings were when this song got released. Did it, you know, invoke this patriotic feeling? I'd definitely be keen to know. I just love listening to patriotic songs. You know, there's no more powerful feeling than being proud of your country, let's be honest. And if you are American, there's quite frankly a lot to be proud of. I, I did, I do like the one line as well when he started uh, referencing, you know, the eagle flying um, and the eagle coming for you. It's, I feel like it could be a pun in some respects because obviously the bald eagle is, you know, one of the most iconic, you know, animals in the United States. But also you get the F-15 eagle, you know, the, the fighter jet, which is one of the most iconic fighter jets of all time. So it could be referring to both at the same time, which I, which I like good lyrics there by Toby Keith. But yeah, you know, I just love American country music. If you folks have any other similar songs to this that you would be willing to recommend, please let me know. I want to react to them all. I thoroughly enjoyed this. I think, you know, after I close this video, I think I might just listen to, listen to it again because it, it had a lot of deep meaning, but it also had like an uplifting feel. I can imagine that this song brought out a lot of emotion, but it also gave a feeling of hope when, when listening to it, especially when it came out. So, you know, anyway, I'm rambling a little bit, but that is all I have for you today, folks. If you did enjoy this video, please remember to like the video and subscribe to the channel. It definitely helps a lot. But until next time, I hope you have a good one. I'll see you when I see you. Cheers.